Looking to upgrade your budget plastic mechanical keyboard to an aluminum one without breaking the bank? At under $100, the Gamma K TK75 Pro is the perfect keyboard for you. What's good? Arjun Bakula here with another solid mechanical keyboard, this time from Gamma K. Gamma K kindly sent this keyboard over to me for testing and review, but they didn't tell me what to say. As always, these are my own honest thoughts and opinions. Now without further ado, let's dive into the unboxing. The Gamma K TK75 Pro mechanical keyboard is an all-aluminum CNC constructed keyboard, meaning it's super solid and heavy that definitely gives it a premium feel. It's not as heavy as the last aluminum keyboard I reviewed, the Womir RD75 Pro, but at 1.8 pounds, it's still a very hefty keyboard that would be able to take a beating or beat someone with if you're that kind of person. The volume knob is also completely aluminum and the base of the keyboard has these big rounded rubbery feet, the kind that won't just easily peel or come off. All in all, this is going to be one long lasting keyboard, at least from a physical point of view. The design of the TK75 Pro is actually pretty bare and minimal, yet it still looks gorgeous in its minimal aesthetic. The smooth rounded aluminum frame is sleek with minimal bezels, no ostentatious designs here. My keyboard came in the black and yellow theme, with the yellow keycaps and printed legends nicely contrasting against the black and grey keycaps. I'm also happy that the visual branding is kept to a minimum, with a small unimposing embossed logo on the lower front and a larger one underneath the keyboard. I have to say I'm enjoying the typing experience from this TK75 Pro so much that I think this is going to be my new daily driver for my home office. The stock sound of the highest synth linear switches and PPT keycaps, as well as of course the many layers of acoustic foam, gives this keyboard a satisfying, marbly creamy feel. One of the best stock experiences I've had so far. Of course, what I'm saying is all subjective, but if you hear and feel for yourself, I don't think you'll be disappointed. This keyboard does a lot of things right, but one thing that is lacking is QMK via support. Although Gamma K does provide its own software support for custom key bindings, macros, and RGB lighting setups, the software can be clunky and potentially unsafe. I've noticed in the past that installing software from some of these Chinese brand keyboards seem to get flagged by my antivirus software. The option to have QMK V support means that the software to further customize your keyboard is safe and reliable. The Gamma K TK75 Pro has been an awesome keyboard to use and looks so damn good on my dark desk aesthetic. It's now taken the spot as my daily driver for my productivity and my home desk setup. I think this keyboard is perfect for those looking to upgrade from the cheap plastic mech keyboard, or even those beginners in this hobby who want their very first mechanical keyboard purchase to have a premium impression. For less than 100 US dollars, you're getting a lot of keyboard here. Premium quality stuff actually, with that all aluminum body, stylish minimal design, and a satisfying typing experience. 
Just having a quick look on Amazon for similarly spec aluminum body keyboards, there's the Epo Maker Tide 75 and the Keyboom Loop 75. Priced a lot higher at around $140 and $170 USD respectively. But those keyboards do have QMK via support going for them. But if customizing your key assignments and RGB lighting isn't necessary for you, then I highly suggest to save the extra $50 or $80 and go for the Gamma K TK75 Pro. If you want to order this keyboard, there are links below in the description. And if you found value in this video, please help bump up that algorithm by hitting the like button or subscribe to my channel to see more awesome content like this.